A stone-flagged floor that was covered in many tombstones was encircled by a carving of bone. The domed ceiling of the cloister was made entirely of interconnecting skulls, their eyeless sockets looking down upon anyone who stood in their dominion. Niches built among the columns of the cloister featured skeletal warriors gripping swords. A large throne made of the bones of long-dead space marines was surrounded by skeletal statues of angels, as well as smiling skulls peering from the armrests and above the tapered top of the throne. Uriel could make out individual femurs, spines and a variety of other bones. They have completely adapted to the grim reality of war and death.